Hey, Scott Amon here from Baru Work and Kelpies uh, with my family. We uh, live on the coast here, just north of Nambucca Heads, and um, we run beef cattle and, um, and a mob of sheep that we use both for eating and to uh, train the dogs on. We've just had something like uh, six inches of rain in the past couple of days, and uh, we're just going around to have a look at stock and paddocks and see what sort of condition they're in. We've got this side-by-side uh, this -side Can-Am Commander. Uh, it's the electric version, so very, very interesting machine. We've got it on loan from the BRP crew, and um, we're going to use it to uh, to check the place out. And uh, I wanted to show you just how it goes in some of the wetter parts and through some creek crossings and what have you. Pretty amazing machines, as quiet as a mouse. Uh, livestock can't even hear you coming up on them. And um, yeah, look, it's, uh, we're probably getting 15, 16 kilometres out of a battery charge at the moment, which isn't a great deal, but I don't think these batteries have had the best the best possible start to their lives, so I think you can get considerably better than that. But uh, come with us and we'll uh, give you a look at how it goes and how it performs and um, we'll see what's going on water-wise on the, on the place after all that rain. Righto, Dotty, you want to hop up? Come around here, Dotty, hop up. Good girl. Certainly up a fair bit. I think we can put cattle back on these flats though. As you can see, this little machine um, can take you wherever you want to go. And um, very, very quiet, very comfortable. Full time, full drive. Or you can flick of a switch, turn it into two wheel drive. You can lock your rear diff if need be. It's got a whole heap of other features I'll run through in a minute. But um, even in these really wet conditions, it's perfect for getting around these damp paddocks and uh, checking out how things are going. And uh, lovely being in a machine that hasn't got a engine, petrol engine or a diesel engine thundering away all the time. Righto, we'll, we'll let this creek slowly come down and we'll get moving.
This is a great little spot we use for camping and family barbecues down the creek. Absolutely beautiful. Water's pretty high at the moment, as you would imagine. Um, a few features I wanted to show you on this um, Commander Can-Am, uh, being the electric version, as we said. Obviously, you've got your targo you can open. Let lazy dogs out. Also, is the fact that it's a tilt tray. This mechanism here allows you to unclip and slowly releases through some shock absorber uh, style arrangements. Uh, if you had rubbish in there or something like that, it'll it'll dump that out. Very easy to close. And incredibly handy. I've used it already. Depo disposing of the odd cheap carcass that's been killed by wild dogs. Just clip him up. Pop up. You can shut this up, good girl. Shut this up pretty quick. Another really good feature underneath this tray. Quite a large storage area. Um, you can see my arm fits. I can't even get my arm right in there. There's a lot of room in there for storing tools or whatever. Very, very handy. Obviously, your roll cages, the rollover protection and what have you. You've got a tow bar, a tremendous rubber for uh, all sorts of terrain. There's the Can-Am Commander E, the electric version. It's got its pluses and minuses like every machine you'll use on a property, but um, for us it, it's proven very good. It's um, quite amazing through pretty wet country. 16, 17, up to 20 kilometres out of a charge. Um, but of course, you can go and do 10 kilometres and then recharge it. So you can just keep charging as need be. Uh, on a farm of a few hundred acres, it seems to work very well. So um, yeah, can't wait to, um, as, as battery technology progresses, can't wait to see what these electric vehicles can do. Um, I'm sure we'll get, uh, I'm sure eventually we'll get out of petrol and diesel powered vehicles and, and into these full time. Good for the environment, good for us, good for livestock because they're so quiet, good for working dogs from. Um, yeah, thanks BRP for the chance to, um, to have a look at them, righto.